I have attached to the front of your handout underneath, this is the Unit 1 uh, interpreting categorical data uh, content, but inside that is actually the table of contents for the text so that you have actually a description of the units and the topics that are in the units. And we'll talk a little bit more about the whole course later. You will notice, though, that it includes, and that's why I had the functions modeling in more, it includes functions in Unit 2. In fact, the modeling is throughout all the courses, and it includes statistics, and it includes discrete mathematics and financial mathematics. The financial mathematics is actually considered algebraic because we do develop um, uh, exponential functions and actual natural natural logarithms for continuous uh, interest and so it is fairly uh, algebraic in nature um, but we also consider that one of the things that uh, the uh, tool that's technology tool that's most used in college you know what that is across courses across disciplines the technology piece They tend to use computers more than graphing calculators, right? The software they use, cross courses the most? Spreadsheets. Spreadsheets. So there is some work in introduction with spreadsheets um, in this course. So that's the um, overall. Um, the instructional model uh, built into these materials um, the instructional model that we've tried to build in the materials that helps people engage students, helps them re require critical thinking and some of the other mathematical practices in the, listed in the Common Core and the NCTM standards.